Murphy, long time no see, man. I think where you been, man. I've been uh, reading a lot of law books as of late. A lot of shit going down. Fuck, I missed you, man. I fuck, I missed you, man. <laughs> missed you too. How you been, motherfucker? How you been, man? Hey, what up, motherfucker? How you doing? I've been pretty good, pretty good. Uh, very busy all of a sudden. Yeah, man. Got, what the uh, fuck is going on with Chang, man? And Vinny? And the boys, man? Well, I mean, I actually their case just got tossed out by the judge for being fucked up. That's that's how that's what? going. What? Yeah. Wait, what happened? What the fuck? The case got tossed because uh, Rico isn't in the penal code, so uh, the, ju the judge Coyote <laughs> tossed the case and said uh, charge him with something that we got charges for. Uh... <gasps> Motherfucker, you said his mom. Motherfucker, you have to be lying, yeah, man. They... April Fools, where's Ashton Kutcher, man? You got to come out here and be pranked, right? These incompetent uh, nope. motherfuckers can't get anything right. God damn. God no, damn. The... Look, the, look, look. The other thing is, is that I sued, I sued them because they put all of their financial records out in the public, and uh, my case got tossed too because apparently that's not public information. But that's bullshit because when. Uh, when that whole case against Sab was going on, fucking Otto came up to me and was talking to me about all the shit in the case. So, that, you know, I mean, something's not right about that. Ah, that shit has always been public information, man. For as far as I know, everybody looks at the government website to see the court cases and talks about it in the city, man. Since the dawn of time. Yeah, because that's that shit that happened with uh, the Tony's name being on the on the thing and and how that fucked him up. Uh, that that's all public information. Jeez, but he's so, saying so, it's, it's apparently not. All right, look, look, look. Explain it in detail again, man. How did this court case get dropped, man? What exactly happened? Hmm? Uh, the judge came in and said that uh, racketeering, uh, the RICO Act is not in the penal code, so they need to come up with actual charges uh, that they can put on them. Specific charges in our penal code. All right. So does this mean they're going to make a RICO charge now? Another boy's free to go, or they still held until new charges present themselves, man. How does this work now? They're, they're not free. Well, I mean, actually, right now they are free. Until there's a case up, they're fine. But once there's a case up again, they go in on a felony. They're held until trial, and I've already told them that, and I got that right from the chief judge. So they're fucked. You know, until they get through this court case, they they can't do shit. Or they Motherfucker, go back to jail. so you're telling me? Is the court case going to get pushed back for another week now until they get their fucking shit together or what, man? Like, uh, like here's my question, had, Murphy. If I had when, to guess, I'd say yes. When does this shit get tossed out and forgotten about, man? As long as I've known the Chang boys, they've been dealing with this shit for a long time, man. It always I mean, seems like... Still, I, look, not disrespect the police, but I, it always seems like they're fucking up somehow, man. They are. They fucked and everything other up. people have look, to pay I'm for it. I'm not a lawyer, but... They can still press charges. They just can't press Rico charges no more. They just can't decide. They can do individual charges. They yeah, can they, they got to individually charge they just can't everyone. Rico to shit. My goal right now, I mean, the main goal is to protect the business for Vinny, but the other main goal right now is to get as many of those co defendants off this thing as possible uh, before this even hits court. Because, uh, you know, it's just going to be easier that way. And I'm sure a lot of these guys got, no got nothing to do with what they're looking for. They, they, you know, they want Vinny and Chang. And everybody else is just, you know, along for the ride. Yeah, All man. All I want to do look, is look, fuck look. over Vinny and take his business away from them. Look, I'm confused, man. So they're still going to be held, right? Or are they free now? No, they're all free. They're all out. They've been searched. Uh, anybody who's got uh, stuff that was found in a search, I think they got warrants. But uh, other than that, everybody's free. They just can't commit any felonies and get busted for any felonies. Well, until, look, uh, right? what? Uh, and why was they, the warrant issued, man? People on Rico. That's what I'm saying, man. How was that fucking violated at all? Love you, baby. Be safe. Well, that's very, very good. Uh, that's a very good question. They they tossed this case like five minutes ago, by the way. So, uh, you know, I, I'm doing everything in real time right now. You know, that's a really good point. I should probably, uh, I should probably fucking bring up another case for violating their rights. If if they were, tr you know, basically searched and seized based you know what the on issue charges is, man? that don't exist. I think that is the bar, man. Signs off of things way too fucking easily, man. 
Yeah. Yeah, maybe. I think literally the cops come to the... Yo, Dennis, I found one piece of leaf weed on Pib. Can I raid him on? Sure, you can raid him. He's corrupted. Do it. And then they raid him, man. <laughs> Just say That's how I feel I'm not like sure it goes, if it man. works like that. <laughs> I'm not sure if it works exactly like that, but I, I, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Um, the, the problem is, like... The, the main problem with the case isn't even the, the procedural shit they're fucking up. It's the fact that, um, based based on hold on everything Murphy, that's been disclosed that. to me. Hold on, one second, man. Yeah, yeah, Real yeah. quick. Yeah, no problem. Hello? Hey, uh, what's your number? Um, ping is number 36, man. I'm going to be like 5-10 minutes if that's okay. I'm in a meeting with my lawyer right now, man. Yeah, just uh, give me a call again. All right, sounds good. We'll do. All right, take care. Take care, man. Yeah. Like, here's my issue, right? Why would uh, a judge approve... Okay, so what was the warrant issued for, man? Based on what? You know, based on what charges? Was it the RICO? They were looking for class twos and drugs. And uh, my my assumption is, uh, you know, what, whatever they're looking for is old shit. Based on... Based on... Uh, a particular witness who might even just be making a bunch of shit up. A uh, particular witness by the name of Caden Delano. Jesus, fuck, man. Stone. Fucking, fucking shit. All right, look. So what was the one based on, though? You know, to look for class twos and drugs based on what, man? Like, what charges, you know? Based on... No, based, based on probably the snitching that fucking Caden did. Motherfucker, this now shit is so the fucked up are, now, man. Like... The main witnesses. There's three witnesses. There's Detective McCormick. Obviously, it's his case, so he's going to be a witness. Then there's Matthew Payne. And then there's Caden Delano. Caden Delano is obviously, you know, knows Vinny the most intimately. They're married, obviously. They just got divorced. So, whatever she said to the cops is probably what they base those fucking warrants off of. But uh, if anything went down, you know, with her involved, uh, hypothetically, you know, that's fucking months ago, dude. So I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Motherfucker, it just makes no sense. How can you raid somebody based on the word of somebody else with no evidence, man? There has to be evidence as well as to why they raided them. There has to be. They have to. I mean, the evidence is the action. You know what I mean? Like, let's Either say... there is or there isn't. I mean, there is, and they are just not showing at this time, or there isn't, and they're fucking it up really badly. All right, look. And why the fuck? Oh, wait. So am I allowed to talk about that court case on the website? Oh no, man. Uh, yeah. I I Public don't knowledge. know. I don't. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I've literally been approached by uh, by by Otto about information from a court case. So that's news to me if that's not public information, because people have definitely been using that shit. Yeah, tell dumb fucks to suck your dick. All right, so here we go then, man. What the fuck is going? Why is paint on the witness list, man? Murphy, that is bad, man. That's really fucking bad, motherfucker. I don't like that that Matthew Payne is on any witness list, and I don't think anybody else should like that either. I'm sitting uh, on two thousand quarter ounces, motherfucker. Two thousand, man. Right, Three hundred well, weight ounces, man. Three hundred. All right. Well, let me put it this way. Well, let me detect uh, snow about this. Beep beep beep. Let me put it this way. Three hundred weed ounces. If Payne, if Payne is just there to verify. Ounces property sales nice. then that's one thing uh anything beyond that then i i mean i might hypothetically have some shit to worry about you know yeah man we both do motherfucker i need to know if i'm putting all the shit in the car man and keeping it out of uh fucking somewhere man motherfucker, this shit's so crazy i don't even know what the fuck i do no more man Look, so is Chang Gang still getting fucked? Just be very careful. Are they good? Yeah, of course. They're, they're definitely still getting fucked. They just have to refile the case. But in the meantime, you know, they gotta lay low. Or they're gonna go to jail. 
and they're gonna have to be in jail awaiting trial. I gotta talk to the judges and find out. If they misfiled shit, doesn't that kind of fuck up the chain of evidence? You know what I'm saying? Like, doesn't that kind of just fuck everything that they got? Because now they don't even know what they got from a RICO seizure and what they got from, you know, you know, justified seizure. So how do they fucking know right. who to charge what with anymore? That's what I'm right. saying. These Minus are all how, great how do you questions. charge anybody and after you? Ever since, ever since I've been in town today, I've been presented with really good questions like this. I'm trying to sort through them one at a time. But basically, I feel like the fact that those bank records were put up there, it's not only bad public information to get out to the whole public about people's personal fucking financial records, but it's also bad for the testimony. Because let's say, uh, for example, Caden wanted to talk about some fucking criminal transaction that occurred on such and such a date. Uh, instead of using her memory and actually giving honest testimony, all she's got to do is look at the bank records, pick one, and say, Oh, yeah, it was for this dollar amount. Oh, shit, you're right, man. My friend, holy shit, but I think there's a reason you're a lawyer, man. Let's go to fuck out. So it calls into question any any facts that are gleaned from her testimony. The fact that she can just reference uh, the evidence that could back up anything she has to say. So I, I got a problem with the whole thing. Uh, already. It's just a matter of going through the research and figuring out what ammunition I have to fight uh, each problem I'm finding. And there's a lot of them, so... But here's my other issue, right, Murphy? Uh... I'm not a lawyer, man, but Chang already spent, like, what, three, four fucking, you know, years in prison? Or two, three years, man? You know, two, three, uh, <clears throat> you know, days? Years, days, you know what I'm saying, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, no, he already he already spent his hold, and uh, but that was based on nothing, right? If the, the case thing. was thrown out, man. Well, they're gonna have to refile it. It's dismissed without prejudice, so they can refile the case correctly. Uh, but if they don't, then yeah, absolutely. All right, so, that, so, do, so they're going to I refile think, it. Uh, they're going to take a couple of days, refile it. In those couple of days, Chen can't do shit. Then once they refile it, they're going to find them, hold them until trial again. Is what you're saying? And then have a court case? I'm sorry, what'd you say just then? I no, but, so second. I'm saying... Is they're going to let them go, right? But in the time that they're free, they can't do shit. Except maybe drive taxi around, right, man? It'll take them a couple of days to... Come up with new charges, man. The minute they do, they're going to hold them again to a trial and then have a court case again? Or how's this going to work now, man? No, they're not going to be held again till trial unless they get picked up on a felony charge. If they get picked up on a felony charge and convicted, they'll go in for holding till trial. That's, oh, that's all right, all right, man. So, but once they have the new charges written, they just have to wait until the court case. They'll still be free, right? Uh, yes, yes. When they refile the case, that doesn't change anything. They just have to do the charges over correctly and, uh, and go from there. But uh, the situation doesn't change on the ground. They're not going back to jail. They're not getting searched again. They just have to refile what they filed this morning. Holy shit. I see why you lawyers hate your job and always have headaches, man. This shit must be fucking crazy to deal with. I mean, it's potentially the biggest case of my career, so I'm actually kind of excited for it. Um, the fact that the state is kind of fucking everything up um, is making me pretty optimistic, too. The only problem I have is, uh, you know, I have personal, I have personal uh, concerns about the witness list. <laughs> like Matthew Payne, Caden Delano, those are not witnesses I want to see on a fucking court case where I'm the lawyer. You know, Caden used to work with me. She, know, she knows how I am. Matthew Payne, he knows how I am. You know what I'm fucking saying? In a courtroom, I know, it doesn't make me feel too good. Yeah, man. Me too, man. They could fucking Me say fucking anything too. on the stand. They could say, oh, yeah, and Murphy Braun was there, too. You know, who fucking knows? Oh, man. Yeah, man. Motherfucker, this shit crazy, man. This shit fucking cr I want to kill that Dennis Abar, Tom off Mountain, man. What you think? Uh, I don't know how that's going to help the case. There's, there's a lot of judges you'd have to Oh, it's not to help with. the case, man. It's to send a message, you know? Mostly like personal revenge, man. Um, I mean, I'd, I'd prefer you didn't get a fucking Rico case right after these guys, but, uh, 
Look, you you do what you feel. I mean, to be. You know, I'm gonna advise. But Murphy, what you think, man? The Rico, okay, a Rico, how does the Rico work, right? It's supposed to take down everybody involved, right, man? Yeah. It establishes that there's an ongoing conspiracy to. But then we're all fucked then, right? Because Tony and Sam work front. at PDM. I've been caught robbing banks with Charles, Chang, all the boys, man. So I have my boys, you know? They've seen us multiple times. I mean, Vinny and Tony own a fucking boat to our business together. Me and Vinny were about to open a business together. How the fuck does this shit work, you know? Hmm. That a big crime network, you know what I'm saying? That a big ass crime network. You got Chang and the boys over here that connected to the fucking lean. And then, you know, if they go even further, then that connect me, you know? Yeah, that, like, man. The rabbit hole is fucking deep, right. motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? No, I know what you're saying. And uh, I would brace yourself uh, in that event for anything uh, that could come your way as far as legal charges. Uh, but I think they're going to be focused on this for a while, so I wouldn't anticipate anything right now. Uh, but keep that in mind. Keep that in mind, definitely. Uh, I have a question. Uh, what was the question? The question is... Um, is it okay to talk in uh, talk frankly with you in front of the pimp? I don't know. I got I, pimp I, my boy, I, man. I don't know the pimp too well. I trust pimp in my life, man. All right. All right. As far as any recent activities uh, that have been going on, like uh, you know that time that that time me and you and Ricky had that talk about some stuff. Anything. Tying you to anything that you guys might have did? Oh, you talking about the pay? Talking about what? What are you talking about, man? Be more specific, man. Pimp is good, man. Yeah, I, I ain't no uh, snitch, motherfucker. Nora, I got, Nora I stuff. With this any, motherfucker. any Nora stuff that you can be tied to? Ah, uh, I mean, we did blow up a car in front of Mission Row with her in it, and had Jacob record the whole thing, and we're gonna put it all over the fucking internet, man. Oh, that was you guys too. Yeah, I was talking I'm... more about the, the kidnapping thing. But, uh, yeah, can any of that be tied to you? Were you masked up? Did you have voice no, changers? No, we could. Did Everything was clean. Anything that we could tie good, you man. to it. No, 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 man. Listen, what about the fuck Nora up, man? We, got to, we, we have, uh, we first recorded her doing cocaine off her desk, man, drinking liquor. We got to put it all over the internet, discredit this woman as much as possible, you know? And her entire law firm, man. Kaden is next. Lisa Gray is next, too, man. Well, K Kaden is fucked. I mean, she's the star witness in a, a Rico case. She's not going to get a public defense case for the rest of her life. She's she's done, and she knows that. Yeah, man. She knows that her but here, life here ain't worth shit. Here's my question, Murphy. Are the judges allowed to write a new law, and then get you on that new law? Is that the, are they allowed to come up with the Rico law now? Pass it and then arrest them on it, or what, man? Nope, nope. They cannot do that. They've already, they've already basically done all the legwork for the investigation, and they've already tried to file it as a RICO, um, and it got shut down. You cannot, you have to charge someone based on the law as it was written when the offense was committed. How, motherfucker, how do the you, cops not think of this shit, man? Like, I'm not trying to be fucking rude, no man, no but how do they not think of this them. shit? How do they not think of this shit? No. Nobody said to think, hey, boys, hey, boys, they man. Have a There's DA, no law that exists here, man. Are you sure you want to do this shit? How does nobody think of this, man? The fucking blows my mind. They ain't, they ain't got a proper district attorney in that motherfucker. You motherfuckers, if they had a proper district attorney, this shit wouldn't have happened. That's what I'm saying, man. I don't even think it comes down to the cops. I think it comes down to whoever fucking runs these laws, man. Does the search warrants, all this shit. Because it, it, it's just hard to fucking believe. The cops had an investigation for months, man. And none of them stopped to think, this law does not exist, man. You sure you want to charge them with it? Nobody stopped to think that shit? Yeah, no, nobody's got the, the proper training in law enforcement to fucking use critical thinking when it comes to legal shit. I mean, they're, they're basically all, uh, you know, meatheads. They just want to go out, shooty, shooty, bang, bang, drive around in their fast cars, and then go home and fuck their wives or something. You know, they, they don't, <laughs> they don't think about what they're doing. <laughs> and, uh, there's not a, there's, there, there's not a strong DA there to think of all this shit before they file court cases either. Yeah, I'm, matter of fact, look, man, I'm a stupid guy, right? But, 
I feel like anybody would have thought of, hey man, I don't think this charge exists. Are you sure you want to do this? I'm surprised that went through, man. I'm really, really shocked. Profit Something big like this, reason. where you're going after literally a pillar of the community, someone who's got a speeding ticket at best on his record, arresting him for supposedly being the ringleader of some massive criminal conspiracy, and something as momentous as that for them to drop the ball so much is uh I, it's it leaves me speechless it, it does man and, and, it's, and it's hard to say so because you know this shit has been going on for a long time man it's always been like this motherfucker every giant court case they fuck up somehow man look at sam shit they blow their load too early they i don't get it i really early, don't get man. it man I, I, I don't even know what the fuck i say i'm happy but i'm also confused man you know it's like when an ugly hooker yeah. suck your dick real good, man. You don't know if you enjoyed it or if you hate it because she's ugly, man. That's how I feel, motherfucker. That's exactly how I feel. I would describe it exactly like that. Um, I don't know whether to be happy or, or disappointed. Because to me, obviously, uh, aside from the fact that it sucks that everybody's uh, getting jacked up here, I mean, for me, career-wise, this could be a really big uh, case for me, you know? Well, that's the to, problem, to right, man. In, in essence, court. watching this court case would have been fucking amazing, man. It would have been fucking amazing, but now look. <laughs> it's crazy. I feel bad. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I feel bad for the cops, man. It's their own fuck up, but I feel bad for them, man. Every well, time they well, get that big actually, opportunity actually, to prove themselves, it seems like they drop the ball, man. Every single fucking time. Actually, it's not. It's not the cops. It's the DA's office. I mean, I'm sure the cops did did what they could to get the evidence together and everything. It's the DA's job to do it properly, though. All right, so, so run and buy me, man. What? How does the DA at fault for this? I don't know if I can last, so I'm not too sure, you know? They didn't do the research, the proper channels. They, you know, dot the T's and cross the I's, motherfucker. Yeah, she didn't She didn't file the case correctly under charges that exist in the penal code. She did it under RICO um, without specifying uh, charges. I mean, there's, there's, there's so much. And all it would have took uh, him was a day. All it would have taken was a day to do that, to get that in order. And then, they have to act after that shit be fucking manifested. You know what I mean? After that shit gets sworn in, bled into the fucking code, then they can act upon it. Alright, so... Exactly. So, so you're saying... So, but, but then the cop go up to the DA and be like, Listen, I want to charge him for this shit. Can I get it approved? Or how does it work, man? Well, what, if what they the were to charge the what they got on paper... Um, then all they can really probably charge them with is what they found in the houses. And, uh, depending on the testimony, um, you know, there's a couple of situations which I think they, they might have testimony about. Some, some things that might, might even, uh, be a problem for Vinny, but it's all hearsay. There's no real evidence, and, uh, you know, they're not going to get all the witnesses they need to, to prove it beyond reasonable doubt. So... I mean, the like, case I, is already falling apart. I think you hit the good tweet of the fucking DAs, man. Completely put somebody new in who knows what the fuck they're doing. And I think the cops need to fucking get their shit together, man. This is fucking crazy, man. Holy shit. Yeah, I think the same motherfucker. <laughs> I mean, obanion has been trying to be the DA for a while now, but uh, no, no one seems to take him seriously. Probably because he just fucking doesn't even wear a shirt half the time. Under yeah. his hoodie. That motherfucker got a good ad, though. That motherfucker <laughs> got a great ad, though. <laughs> That is true. It is a pretty good ad. All right, Murphy, talk to me, man. Look, they did a search warrant for Rico. That search warrant has to be invalid now, right? There's no way that it could be used as evidence, right? Uh, not necessarily. Again, I need I need some like me time to like do my research on all of this stuff because it's like there's ten things that have come up since I woke up that uh, are potential problems with their case. And I've had to do research on every bit of it. I already filed one lawsuit over this case, uh, and and that got tossed, like I said. But I'm gonna I'm gonna have a talk with somebody about that because uh, that that is public information. Yeah, man. And has yeah, man. always been treated as no. Public it's information. always been public information, man. Literally, everybody uses that shit as public information, man. Everybody, every single motherfucker that's ever been to the city, man. Exactly. And so for him to say that, that it has never been used and never will be is just a load of horseshit. Uh, who told you that, man? Out of curiosity, hmm? 
uh, Judge Coyote. Oh, well, he's the new judge, right? Maybe he uh, maybe he doesn't know that it's been used for a long time, man. Yeah, because, uh, I mean, <laughs> that's how I got Sab's case dropped. So I, t I told the chief of police, you guys fucked up. You, you outed people's uh, names and shit in the uh, court filing. You know, this we got to make this go away, you know? Motherfucker, I just feel bad for everybody involved, man. Chang, Vinny, and them spending time in jail for what looks like no reason. The fucking cops Keep spending the months on Coming investigation. Bro. I just Great get thrown content. out, man. It's fucking some crazy shit, man. This some crazy shit, motherfucker. <laughs> Unfortunately, what this means, what we gonna have to do, is we gonna have to wait even longer now to know what proper, how to properly address this shit, motherfucker. Yeah, and, and here we are. It's day one, and we're already seeing delays. Yeah, I mean, exactly. talk, eight, I wouldn't call this a delay, man. I call this a fucking monumental delays. fucking fuck up, man. This shit is, is crazy, man. Is. And it's just, it, motherfucker, it's just hard to believe. It's just hard to believe, man. I can't believe CID doing investigation and somebody over the fucking criminal charges does not exist. That, that shit is crazy, man. How does nobody stop to think about this shit, motherfucker? I don't get it, man. I don't get it, man. Well, people get excited. <laughs> You know what the thing it is, man? blow they load too early. Bullshit, man. I don't fucking know, you know? But, hey, the boy's going to be free. I don't care about, man. Well, they're not out of the woods yet. Ah, uh, I think they will be, man. If you and Shah and this together, I'm sure there's so many more fuck-ups in this court case, man. I'm just waiting for it to be thrown out now, man. I'm pretty sure, like, I don't know, man. It's just weird, man. I don't know how the search one is now valid, you know? But we'll see. We'll see. I hope for their sake they recover good and, uh, you know, pull through. But we'll see, man. I hope they're good. I hope they're good. But, you know, some part of me, I, I, I wish they, you know, hadn't fucked up so much already. Yeah, man. It's just, it, it's just not a good look. It's not a good look. It's not a good look, motherfucker. And the thing is, is nobody has faith in the justice system, man. For a long time, and there's reason why, right? Looking at Seb case as the most recent, not including this one, right, man? So, you know, to try to give them some relief and for them to do this shit all over again, motherfucker, it's like, what the fuck are you doing now, man? I think you get rid of the whole thing, get somebody else in charge, redo everything, man. Reconstruct everything and make it proper, man. Because that shit is fucking crazy. Yeah, but who's going to be the DA? Who wants, who wants to be the DA? I'm not going to be the DA. Fuck that. I'll end up in the trunk of a car in no time. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. I think DA, judges, you know, all that shit needs to be looked at, man. Because somebody would, would have had to approve the search warrant for a recall, right? Somebody had to approve it. It's uh, crazy. Yeah, nobody, no, nobody stopped to think. Of course it was Dennis, man. The Dennis would do anything for the cops, motherfucker. Here's the thing, man. How the fuck nobody stop even a judge himself and stop to see that there's no fucking law for this shit on the penal code, man, that shit crazy. Well, I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to wait and see what, what happens with this. I'm gonna check the docket right now, actually, to see if there's been any changes. Yeah, nothing, no, no changes. It's still just tossed out. That's crazy, man. Murphy, you let me know the minute I need to move everything from those houses, man. And if you ever see me get picked up, you go to those houses and you move everything, all right? You're the only one that has the keys, man. I'm the only other person that has the keys? Yeah, yeah. To our, the one on our phone drive that's only between me and you, the one on first lane, the boys can grab, all right? But if you ever see us picked up, you have to go move all that shit for us if you can, man. All right, all right. All right, motherfucker. Right, just, be, just be very careful who you trust and who you talk to. Because no, we don't of know course, man. who all is, is going to be uh, added as witnesses in this thing. Uh, who else can back up with these uh, Matthew Payne and Caden and all that. Uh, just be very careful. Be careful what you talk about with anyone. What's your bank account? All right, never mind. All right, sound good. I expect to buy a transfer soon, too, man. For all the shit you've done for me and the boys, all right? All right. All right, 21. be careful, guys. Take care. All right, later, motherfucker. This motherfucker know his shit. Ah, Murphy, fucking Murphy and Shaw, man. Those two together on a fucking case? Holy shit. Hey, Shaw, my lawyer.
I just feel bad, man. To be honest, man, I was excited to see this court case, man. You know, grab some popcorn, sit back, smoke some weed, chill, watch it, man. I was excited to grab up the witnesses. Yeah, man. Now it's all bullshit. I mean, hopefully it's not, but we'll see. Vinny is going to be so pissed, motherfucker, holy shit, man. He doesn't know what the fucking... He doesn't... He tells me... He said in that clip that, uh... About it's my fault because how do you drain the funds from PDM? I used to physically pay myself my weekly, which was always the same, and used to pay the employees that only used to leave about 20 to 30 grand in the account every single week. So... They don't even know what they're talking about. <laughs> Honestly, they have no clue what they're talking about. <laughs> Just basing it off assumptions, you put a person that was never charged with a crime, they put him in jail, and now to find out that the case is dismissed just blows my mind completely. Completely blows my mind. Listen, I, I'm gonna give you some food for thought. This is the main thing I wanted to talk to you about. What's up? Um, as far as far as Caden, mm -hmm. she's your fucking lawyer. Yes, she was, and she represented me. Anything that you can think of that falls under attorney-client privilege, you, you think of it and jot it down. Everything. She's my lawyer and my wife at the time. All right. Just, uh, yeah, anything that might apply to attorney-client privilege uh, that wouldn't otherwise normally apply to spousal privilege. He is a privilege. genius. Uh, we should be able to... Chat, really he is a genius right now. Testify against you. So just... Come up with anything that you guys might have talked about that would you definitely are fall a, under that. You privilege. are a fucking genius, okay? Let me explain that to you. Hey, it's what I do. It's if that I bitch do. is not killed before I before the case even happens, to be honest, because right, yes. stop, stop. The Look, gator coming in with yeah, the I, I, three I know months. How you thank get, you so much, we, dude. Now is not the time to be irrational, okay? Murphy, she's literally doing exactly what Nora does and just sits at the hospital. I seen her last night. She didn't even try to say a single word to me. She thought by her putting a, a backwards hat on and some fucking big-ass glasses, I wouldn't know who she was. Like, does she think I'm that fucking stupid, Murphy? I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah. Keywords. Attorney-client privilege. Whatever we can have fall under that. Uh, depending on what she's going to testify about, it, it should provide a lot of protection. It's at least going to trip up their case a, a great deal if it doesn't get her removed entirely off the witness stand. Exactly. So, uh, and that's also, the only motherfucker I'm worried with, about. Uh, if you get in touch with Charles, you can let him know that his warrant is not for uh, held until trial or any kind of stuff to do with the race. So, let me ask you house. a question. It's we were just told. A street racing warrant. Yeah, so or, now that the or something. now that the 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 case is gone right now, none of us could be held until trial, correct? Because there's no if case. If they try to do that, I mean I mean obviously if if anybody gets picked up, they need to call me uh or call a lawyer. Uh and if they try to hold them till trial, uh that needs to be fought tooth and nail because if there's no case, then there's no hold. You know what I mean? They can't. So they, that, that's that, that would be, be illegal. Happening. Exactly. But once the case is live and active, I have that on the highest authority that uh, any felonies and and so again until trial. So these motherfuckers ruined my name, took money out of my pockets, did all of that. Never been arrested in my life before, and they throw me in jail. And the case gets dismissed without prejudice, whatever the fucking that shit means. Are you fucking kidding me? I am gonna sue these motherfuckers and I'm gonna push that these cocksucking detectives get fired for ruining my name. Alright, I, I gotta go down to PD. Yeah, go, let's, go. Uh, let's meet up in like 10 minutes, okay? Yeah. I'm gonna put it- I'm gonna make sure the lead investigator on that case is gonna be fired because of ruining Vinny's name. I could bet my life on that. Yo, Lang's just, uh, Yo, eating in his head. Oh, that's fine. So, again... What's up, you, you gotta understand where I'm coming from, the way I feel. I was never... I never had a criminal charge in my life. They throw me in a three-day hold. They ruin my name. I had people coming up to me telling me how you're a business owner that you own a fucking... How are you a business owner if you're a criminal? 
You understand what I'm trying to get from? To all, and all of this to be dismissed? To refile? Like, you fucking yeah, serious? Yeah, they tried to charge you with stuff that's not even in the, in the current penal code. They totally fucked everything up. And, and then you try to put a lawsuit against the DA and they shut that down immediately? Uh, like, hello? Over something that's not even valid. Oh, big news, brother. Big news. You want to hear? You, you know how they told you, Murphy, this is a months on months on months on months of investigation? Mm -hmm. the, a the ADA is going to my employees from the dealership asking them questions about me. If they know any legal activity about me, have they heard anything f about me? They have absolutely the ADA dick. directly is doing Yep, that? exactly. So they're, they're harassing your current employees? Yeah, and I can't do nothing. Can I do something about that? Can we go to a judge about that? Not really. It's I mean, it's not illegal for them to investigate, but... You know, but they told it, this is they you know they said this is a months on months on months they have this investigation going. Meanwhile, they have the ADA asking questions to my employees because they have absolutely dick on me. That's true. But again, on the face of it, it is not illegal for them to ask questions or or want to question people. Um, how they go about it is, you know, obviously, you know what's in good taste is in good taste and. You know, harassing behaviors. Oh, then, then, uh, then it even gets shape. better. It even gets better. They offered her if she did have any, uh, any, any info on me. They offered her witness protection. So they're ba they're basically coming out and saying, "Oh, your boss is an arch criminal. We'll yeah. protect you from him if you tell it, tell us all about him." Yeah. Ain't that fucking some shit, huh? I can't wait to get on the other side of this. I mean, I'm already confident that we're going to win based on how they're doing so far. But uh, it'll be good to get get this over with so you can get back get back to your fucking life. I'm, I'm telling you right now, after this is all in, done and said and we win this case because I know we're not losing this case. I'm going to put this fucking city in so much debt that they're going to go. The city, the state's going to have to go bankrupt because of me after what they're doing to me. Alright, well, for James, now... James, thank you for that two months, brother. Save, Queen, uh, thank you for the hundred bits. The Welcome to the shock calls, my dude. The ADAs and everybody in the lawsuits for after. Oh, shit! Right Do now, it, ma! For now, right now, the priority is the criminal case against you. If, if they're even gonna have one up. You know? We gotta focus on that. First things first. So... Yo, Nooch, what up, Have baby? Thank you for that donation. What I said uh, a little while ago about about attorney-client privilege. Yeah. So this is yo. Listen to this. Murphy's a fucking genius. Caden was my wife and my lawyer. So that might fuck her whole witness testimony up, Lang. Motherfucker, are you serious, man? Yup. That's attorney client privileges, and I could just bullshit about it. But she knows a lot when I was fucking, when I had to go to cases and stuff. Oh shit, motherfucking Murphy, you genius, man. Holy shit. It's, it's probably not foolproof, but it's enough to call into question, you know, basically Caden's credibility as a witness is near zero if we can create reasonable doubt. Uh, if she's your attorney and she's violating privilege, that's reasonable doubt. If she's got a grudge against you because you're her ex-husband and, you know, possibly making things up against you, that's, that's, a, that hits her credibility pretty hard. Um... But how can, how can, uh, how can your ex-wife testify against you, man? Is that legal? They can't be how forced to. They can't be forced to, but they, uh, they can if they want to. Lenora shit. But if it's non-criminal, if it's like if it's not specifically about a crime, then even if you're divorced in California, she would need your consent to actually discuss confidential matters while you were married that you discussed. Yeah, but Guardian, without that, so they have nothing. Guardian. If specifically conspiring to commit crimes together, then she could testify. But there's so many things that fall beneath that 
that she, she won't be able to talk about anything unless it's something that she can prove was a crime that you did. Yep. Party and shit, man. That's fucking thing to win. Oh, yeah. Fuck her bro. testimony is pretty much fucked because she was your attorney. She was the dealership's attorney. She did all the contracts for you. Uh, I mean, she was, you know, I'm your lawyer, but she was more like the day-to-day -day lawyer for mm -hmm. the dealership than I was. Oh, sure, for sure. So most things you've discussed, we can argue falls under privilege. Can't use it. Perfect. Motherfucker, you are, you are a genius, Murphy. Good shit, man. Good fucking shit. So she just pretty much exposed herself for nothing. Yeah, she's just a fucking typical snitch like the rest of her friends. I think it just runs in their blood. But no, let's not get too excited so and start crazy, sucking man. each other's I dicks just yet. Yeah, exactly, man. I, Vin, I, I don't know, man. I, I'm pretty sure you're going to get fucked, man. What the? What do you mean? How is, how is he going to get fucked? How is he going to get fucked? Is it a crime Mother, to make too like much they, fucking I money? Like, Motherfucker, I feel like they have to have some more shit on you, man. There's just no way all this shit happens if they don't have evidence, man. I refuse it, to believe. It, isn't everything supposed to be on the, on the case? Concern. Isn't everything have to be on the case when they post it? There's gotta be something they're holding back. There's gotta- no, they, they- there's a discovery process, they can add stuff late if they want to. I feel like they're probably holding some stuff back for now. Mm. So we gotta be prepared for one or two more witnesses, maybe some other evidence comes in. Um, you know, this is just the- this is just the appetizer. But I mean, to me, it's one of those situations where it seems so obvious you're going to lose, and it makes me think they're holding back the wild card, you know? They still have this in their hand, man. They haven't shown all their fucking, you know, cards and shit. Because it just seems so fucking ridiculous, man. It really fucking does. But, motherfucker, if this shit is all based on bullshit, Vinny, I feel sorry for you, man. Lang, don't feel sorry right, for me, Vinny. my friend. If I lose the dealership, this whole city is getting turned upside down, my friend. I'm going after everybody. Vinny, is there anybody else who isn't listed on that uh, court case? That's outside of your inner circle, besides your wife, that can prove uh, um, testimony or evidence for that you're Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, read and Red. Read and Red. Okay. Um, Shit! I wait, mean, wait, I, wait, I wait, wait. I know Reed's got a history it... with making deals, but oh, yeah, uh, he used Red, to... the fuck, isn't hand... Red fucking boys with Negan, man? Yeah, exactly, Were they trying to take your fucking shit? Yup. What, what would what he know, Red man? Know? Red knows about before, before... When I dealt with those fucking big toys. I used to sell them to him. Directly? Can, can he prove it? Well, I sold it to him directly. I don't know if he could prove it, but I sold it to him directly, yeah. That's not good. Yeah, that is not good, man. But, but you see, you, you guys see where I'm coming from, though, right? Like, mm -hmm. it just seems so obvious that they're going to lose that they have to have a trap card, man. They have to sleeve, you know? You know what's funny? You know what's you know what funny? the other thing is? Hold on, hold on. By the on. way, hang on. Wait, 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 Murphy. Hang on, hang on. I, no, 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 I, I, no, 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 Murphy. Say Shh. I gotta say something really important about the whole red situation. If you notice, I'm just thinking about this now. They never did anything further after his case. Remember, they found all the guns, and they did absolutely nothing about it. Oh shit! Hmm. Actually, that's a good point, man. I've always wondered how the fuck he got let go for that shit, man. All right, for, for the time being, we, okay, he has I to know, die. I know you, you, I know you, I know you've made up with Shaw and all that. Uh, I don't know what the deal is there, but we we can't trust him with everything. Okay, we gotta assume that you know he might be compromised at least somewhat. Uh, obviously, he can't legally hurt you without hurting himself. But uh, if he's feeding back information to Negan or anything uh, inappropriate uh, like that, you know. Just, he could be a snake in the grass. Just be, be careful. Well, it's like my face said, man. We can't start sucking each other's dicks off yet, man. Look, I just have a feeling they have something else, man. Because I, I just refuse to believe somebody's going to investigate you for months. And this is the bullshit they fucking have to offer, man. Mm-hmm. You All know? Because right. um, they were so which, there, confident there was... and cocky to fucking put you away, man. 
makes me think that they have something that we don't know, man. Probably, you're right. I think so, too. But speaking of something else, back to what I was gonna say, uh, I spoke to the ADA about what the fuck is happening with this case, and, mm -hmm. uh, first of all, she said that they're hoping to get it back up tonight, fixed. Uh, oh, so fixed. That, you know, <laughs> we know what's, we know what's going on. Uh, and what you're actually being charged with. And, uh, the other thing that she mentioned, I don't know if it was a slip or what, but she mentioned that she, uh, isn't that involved with this case, but, uh, she got dragged into it, but she was working on another case that she really wants to get rolling. So, I don't know if, Oh, uh, shit, man, it's cause she be me, cause she be talking about me! <laughs> I would prepare for that fucking possibility. Or the red but, case. Uh, she said she's working on another case, and when the DA's working on a case, it means, uh, you know, could be could be bad for somebody. So, oh, just a shit, heads up. I fucking hope it's not me, man. I really fucking hope it's I, not I, me, man. Lang, like they're trying to put us all away. <laughs> they're, gonna be, they're gonna be real fucking not busy for a while if you all go away. I'll tell you that much. Fuck, shit. This shit is fucking insane, man. I feel like our world is falling apart, boy. Yep. The ground is crumbling beneath us, man. But I agree with Buddha. I think that they've got a trump card of some kind, that they've got a witness that can tie everything together. Um, off the top of my head, uh, based on everything I know, that that witness could be Nora, or it could be somebody else. It could be someone like Red. But whoever it is, um, I'm personally not going to accept any outcome where the fucking witness doesn't take the stand and look you in the eyes and testify. Mm-hmm. So wh whoever oh, it is I mean, and has, whatever it is, why the fuck would it be any different? It. <laughs> it can't be any different, right? Murphy Braun. I have no fucking clue anymore, bro. This shit is so fucked. This shit is... You just do what you gotta do. That's all I'm telling you. She just got thrown off a bridge. I hope you're Are free, you man. kidding me? I hope you're free, man. But let's, uh, right, let's right, wait and I'll see, right. you know? Wait, who got thrown off a bridge? My fucking fiance got thrown off a bridge, apparently. Oh, marvelous. Party it's not one shit! Thing, it's a fucking other thing. I right, go do yeah. your thing, don't worry, hey, go, go see her, man, go see her, man. That will be good. Carlos, if you hear right. anything, man, especially on that fucking case, man, holy shit, I'm scared, motherfucker, I'm scared, man! <laughs> Alright, you're, you're gonna be fine, you're both gonna be fine. <laughs> uh...